Hello, can you believe the TV series Star Trek Voyager was released 28 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now? Who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Kate Mulgrew was born on April 29, 1955, in Dubuque, Iowa, USA. She played the character Captain Catherine Janeway in the TV series when she was 40 years old in 1995. She is currently living happily at the age of 68. Good idea. I'll join you. Janeway out. I want the two of you to analyze the alien generator, then see what you can find out about this SOS call. You forced me to perform an Irish jig. That's oh Oh, no, wait, that's absurd. That's something I always... Ethan Phillips was born on February 8, 1955, in Garden City, New York, USA. He played the character Neelix in the TV series when he was 40 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 68. Oh, isn't it beautiful? I doubt the captain would think so if she found it crawling around in her salad. I, I guess it's the fact that uh, that, 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 that it, it kind of embodies a, a lot of hope, uh, you know, in 400 years. Jerry Ryan was born on February 22, 1968, in Munich, West Germany. She played the character Seven of Nine in the TV series when she was 29 years old in 1997. She is currently living happily at the age of 55. Not anymore. I read even say otherwise. You're very particular about who you are. Big um, mystery that we see, we learn a little bit more about in episode 4, and that will be um, following through the duration. Robert Belchan was born on November 19, 1953, in Bakersfield, California, USA. He played the character Commander Chakotay in the TV series when he was 42 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 69. I pray on this day of memories to speak to my father, the one whom the wind called. <laughs> I never could figure out why all the alien bad guys had English accents. Garrett Wang was born on December 15, 1968 in Riverside, California, USA. He played the character Anson Harry Kim in the TV series when he was 27 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 54. Glad you could join us, Mr. Kim. Harry, welcome back. Thanks. Reporting for duty, sir. The doctor gave me a clean bill of health. Did I miss anything? Paris. Paris. Par Paris has made an appearance on Lower Decks now. <laughs> yes, he has. Uh, so I feel like it's only time, like it's only a matter of time before you get there. I know. Uh, if, if Roseanne Dawson was born on September 11, 1958, in Los Angeles, California, USA. She played the character Lieutenant Belana Torres in the TV series when she was 37 years old in 1995. She is currently living happily at the age of 64. Stop the breach. At the last second, we did. Why didn't the crew return to the ship? Because they couldn't. The Kazon tractored all the life pods onto the sat on a real lake, on a real frozen lake. In Canada, right? And in Canada, in Winnipeg, where we were majorly sub-zero temperatures, like oh. way below. Yeah. Um, it was very... Raphael Sabash was born on February 12, 1964, in New York City, USA. He played the character Michael Charnas in the TV series when he was 32 years old in 1996. He is currently living happily at the age of 59. Crew knowing it. Well, that's for me to worry about. Let's just say I'm very familiar with communications protocols. Now, will you let me talk to Sesc? However, um, we are now home to the largest community of people dealing with food scarcity. It's 1.5 million people, right? So that's a population of some states. So what, what we try... Tim Ross was born on June 22, 1956, in Washington, D.C., USA. He played the character Lieutenant Tuvok in the TV series when he was 39 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 66. Regarding Kess. Explain. 
Internal sensor logs show that she destabilized the Jeffries tube at the molecular level. The effect weakened the infrastructure. A movie uh, right. that was done that they did as a PBS film um, took place in the in the uh, days of slavery, late 1800s. All right. Um, and uh, you know, I, I worked. On Robert Duncan McNeil was born on November 9, 1964, in Raleigh, North Carolina, USA. He played the character Lieutenant Tom Paris in the TV series when he was 31 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at age of 58. An example of indiscreet shipboard fraternization. Really? Sorry, I missed it. Deck six. You know, outdoorsy and bonding and nature and all those things. And my mother would forbid me from riding on the... Robert Picardo was born on October 27, 1953, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, USA. He played the character Doctor in the TV series when he was 42 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 69. Now, display schematics for all sick bay holographic systems. No holographic systems exist in sick bay. And uh, I think what made him particularly fun for the fans, <coughs> excuse me, is that he did not have to behave like a regular. Tom Virtue was born on November 19, 1957, in Sherman, Texas, USA. He played the character Lieutenant Walter Baxter in the TV series when he was 38 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 65. We got so cold. Cold. I didn't notice it at first. I was working out so hard. Then I realized it was under 10 degrees C. The environmental controls didn't respond to my commands and neither did the... It was a healthy change. Um, change that... I, I needed to see, and I think that we as an organization and as a movement. Josh Clark was born on August 16, 1955, in Bethesda, Maryland, USA. He played the character Lieutenant Joe Carey in the TV series when he was 40 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 67. Look at this. I think there's some kind of apple. There are trees filled with them as far as the eye can see, just over that ridge. Tariq Ergen was born on June 7, 1961, in Hingham, Massachusetts, USA. He played the character Lieutenant Ayala in the TV series when he was 34 years old in 1995. He is currently living happily at the age of 62. Irrelevant! Take me back to the board. I can't do that. Let me know who's your favorite character from the TV series Star Trek Voyager and share your thoughts by leaving your comments under this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you